Phoenix, Rod Wood told Lions season ticket holders that Detroit would never give up its annual Thanksgiving game. A few weeks later, Philadelphia came for it. The Eagles submitted a rule proposal that would force Dallas and Detroit to alternate hosting Thanksgiving games, with the other going on the road. Detroit has hosted a Thanksgiving game every year since 1934, Lions fans can rest easy for now, as Philadelphia withdrew its proposal before, deliberations even began this week at the owners' meetings. But Woods said the Eagles believe Detroit has an unfair competitive advantage by hosting the game every year. They proposed it on the basis of competitive equity, Wood said. That's all it said. I think the thought process was the short week and the travel for whoever those two opponents are for those two games, puts them at a disadvantage. Obviously, we're very much supporting the current system and keeping it that way. I won't get into what happened or why they withdrew it, but there was enough momentum generated by Detroit, Dallas and other teams to keep the tradition of the two games. They withdrew it and it was never voted upon, Eagles owner Jeffrey Lurie said as much himself, and it's not difficult to understand where he's coming from. Philadelphia has traveled for Thursday road games each of the last two years, and four of the last five. And with rumors swirling the club will have to play in Minnesota on Thanksgiving this year, that'd be five out of six. Detroit has played three road Thursday games in its history, and none at all since 2000, we do a lot of data analysis of schedules and things like that, and short weeks because you're trying to prepare and recover and all those kinds of things. Larry said, and one of the things that came up was the difficulty sometimes of short weeks on Thursdays. Nobody wants to play away on Thursday night on a short week, and we feel it should be a balanced schedule in terms of teams that have to play on a short week, away. That's all. It has nothing to do with Thanksgiving. It's a great tradition in Detroit, Dallas, whatever. But just on a competitive basis, as soon as you look at the schedule, you want to know, are you on short week on a Thursday? The Eagles clearly have strong feelings on the matter, so it's unclear why they withdrew their proposal without so much as a discussion about it at the owners' meetings. Asked if he strong-armed the Eagles into waving the white flag would decline to elaborate, I said I won't get into what we did, so don't try to put words in my mouth. Would joke. Even though I'm tired, you're not going to throw me off my game. 